emotional and raw. My family and I are in such shock. Our beautiful boy was taken from us. And right now it doesn't feel like life can ever be joyful again. Ruby Saleh, the sister of Fahim Saleh, the tech entrepreneur who was killed inside his Lower East Side apartment last month, talks candidly for the first time about the disturbing murder that sent shockwaves across the city. My brother's death was a crime of the most cruel and heinous nature. The video tribute was published Thursday alongside a powerful and heartbreaking post on Medium.com on the one-month anniversary of the murder. Saleh's body was discovered by a family member inside his condo along East Houston Street. A former assistant, 21-year-old Tyrese Haspel, was later arrested and charged with the murder. In her own words, Ruby Saleh describes reading the headlines that ensued after news broke about the killing. This was my baby brother they were talking about. My Fahim, whom when I was eight years old, my parents brought home from the hospital to me in an orange fleece blanket. My brother was brilliant, creative, spontaneous, whimsical. My family and I will do everything in our power to keep Fahim's memory alive. Sharing family photos, Ruby Saleh described a childhood of struggle and perseverance, being raised in an immigrant family from Bangladesh that later settled in Louisiana in search of the American dream. With a desire to succeed, her brother Fahim started building websites at 12 years old. He would later thrive as an app developer. Most of these apps have started out by... I sat down with Saleh back in 2018 when he spoke about that early success launching his first app, Prank Dial. It was more of a joke when I first started. It, and it, it became an actual business. While his family grieves, their hope is that his life isn't defined by how it shockingly ended. If you're someone's sister, the next time you see your brother, please hug him as tightly as you can for as long as you want. Because that's all I want to do every time I see those photos. Now, Haspel Saleh's former assistant has pleaded not guilty to murder. He's expected in court next week. On the Lower East Side, I'm Andrew Ramos, Pix 11 News.